right, well, we just landed in Rapid City, South Dakota. I'm surprised it's no Well, it's the uh, ending of our first hike this first morning. Brandon and I walked probably two and a half miles, just getting to know the area, really putting boots on the ground. Super windy, can't really hear anything. We let loose on a ridge to see if maybe something would be sparking up. And we come off that ridge to get on this road to walk back. There's fresh turkey tracks across on the road. So we know there's birds here. We're getting in the right area, we're scouting. And hoping if we get a bluebird morning come roll around we can get the job done here in nebraska we've seen three groups of birds one of them was on public the other two were on private going in between two pieces of public uh, we had a chance to make a move on them they're working in a creek bottom towards us but decided that they were just going to go up a ridge and down in a different bottom met some good people along the way heard some interesting stories and the wind still has not let up as you can hear it is roaring through these trees and basically we're just putting as much boots on the ground covering area trying to find roost you know just getting ready for when the wind isn't so isn't so fast maybe we can get really settle down and play the game with them
coming in. If we can get front call to him, he might come right in. Well, we got in. We we worked our way up a creek bottom, you know. We from the south. We gonna find some water. Uh, we worked our way up the creek bottom. Uh, then we went up. It was pretty steep on both sides, spilling in. We went up this left side. Got into this stuff right here. You can see a bunch of hills, a few trees to break it up. And got on a group of those old Miriam. Uh, tried to get around on them three, three times, three, four we, times. Yeah, and they're just whew, just faster than we are, or faster than we can be. That's one thing I've got a new appreciation for this true open running. It's not like Mississippi field, so you just get in the woods and head around. You gotta you be strategic. You don't have a lot of cover, but you got a lot of ground to cover. So we just after watch out. That's a little good. But uh, so yeah, we chased them, chased them, chased them. Uh, crazy thing is, we could hear them with a normal just flock of turkey vocalizations, but never heard anything like to us until we got the last time. Give them some time and ease up behind them, and we heard a gobble over at the top of the ridge. And your guess is good of mine where they went. They just disappeared on us. Yep. Alrighty, well, this is the last afternoon we have to hunt here in Nebraska. We have found a good handful of birds, and every single one of them was either a giant group of hens, private that outfits hunts, or hend up like crazy. So we're gonna make this last ditch effort on this WMA. See if we can't scratch at least one of them out. 